tayo po ito kami ngayon Lord gabayan niyo po kami sa training namin at sa mga susunod pa po mga araw Lord Lord gabayan niyo po yung katawan po namin ilayan niyo po kami sa sakit at sa injuries and yung mga families po namin na sumusuporta po sa amin gabayan niyo po kami in this name po
one of the most important traits of a person is to be independent. Yung hindi ka umasa sa ibang tao. Most importantly, if you're really trying to achieve something, if you're really trying to uh, do your task every single day and stay committed, uh, for me, being able to trust yourself and uh, not to depend on anyone is one of the most important things. Kasi it's not every day na pare-parehas yung tulong na nakukuha mo. It's not every day na pare-parehas yung tao na nasa paligid mo. After a week, something might change. After a month, the person na sanay kang kasama might leave. So, there are constant changes in our lives every single day. And if sanay ka na umaasa sa iba, your work will also depend, your progress will also depend, your improvement will also be dependent on those people, on the situations na sanay ka. So for me, one of the greatest traits of someone is to be able to work on his own, to be able to move on his own, decide on his own, which is very important. So they trained a while ago, and uh, ako, uh, sinabi ko naman sa kanila, I'll always be there most of the time, pero there will be times na talaga hindi ako makakasama kasi I'm gonna finish something and marami rin ako ginagawa. Pero I believe for how many years of training with me, natuto sila not only the program, hindi lang kung ano yung kailangan nila gawin for today, but to be independent, but to be able to make a way, find a way kung paano nila gagawin yung kailangan nila gawin without getting any help from me. And for how many years, pinrepare ko sila sa mga gantong sitwasyon. It's for me uh, to be able to get the maximum results from them. And uh, I think they're very successful. Hindi dahil nakapag-train sila. For me, hindi dahil nakapag-200 made shots sila. Hindi dahil nagawa nila yung program na pinapagawa ko sa nila. Pero to be able to convince themselves that they're gonna train with or without me. It's a very, very important uh, attitude of a player na na de develop na nila ngayon and they are starting to master that kind of attitude. So guys, if you're trying to achieve something, wag mo yasa sa iba. You really have to work on your own. You really have to be uh, independent and be able to work on your craft every single day with or without help from anyone. Bye guys. Kamusta? Ano ang tipta nito? Ang tipta? Ang tipta nito na. Hello? Yes ma'am, yes ma'am. Yes ma'am. Sige po, tawag lang po kayo ulit. Sige po. Thank you ma'am. So that was an inquiry from Saudi and nakakatuwa kasi gusto nila mag-travel from there going here para lang makapag-train with us and nakikita daw niya kasi madalas yung son niya na pinapanood yung vlogs natin so hanggang Dubai I mean hanggang Saudi umaabot yung vlogs and nakakatuwa marami na yung inspire na tao meron lang ako biglang naalala kasi uh, two years ago meron nag-enroll sa amin from Singapore uh, sabi niya kasi parang niya nakilala yung maps nagsisearch daw sa, sa internet and sabi uh, nag-search daw siya ng training camp sa Philippines and uh, marami daw lumabas tapos yung MAFS daw yung number one recommended buong bansa and ako nagulat ako sabi ko sir saan yung nakita yun kasi ako personally I don't know how big MAFS is hindi ko alam kung hanggang saan kami talaga umahabot I just continue working on what I really love and hindi ko iniisip kung sikat na kami or kung gano'n na kami kalaki so I hear those kinds of things from other people nakakatawa, it inspires me and it makes me wanna work harder so yes, umabot tayo ibang bansa and I'm gonna continue making more videos uh, more inspirational, motivational videos para, para sa lahat lahat na naroon sa atin so, this thing is heavy Whew. So 6 to 8 p.m. we'll work on our shooting. Pero ngayon nandito sila sa labas working on their ball handling. And it's already uh, almost 5 p.m. So they have almost one hour to work on their ball handling. And then uh, mamaya diretso kami sa court. And this is gonna be the second session of the day. I gave them uh, almost the whole day after the training kanina umaga. The rest that they need para makarecover. Para maka all out sila mamaya. And then tomorrow 3 a.m. again. It's the same routine every single day. Gaya yung sounds mo, nanginibago ako. Baka maka-copyright ko. Ha? Baka maka-copyright ko. Okay lang yun. Ba't ganda na yung ganda mo ngayon? Pusahanin na. Ha? What changed? 
Ay, sorry. No. <laughs> Nawala yung motivation ni Sal. Ayaw na, ayaw na. <laughs> niya, bakit niya, ano nga nagbago? Ba't gano'n yung mga kanta mo? Di ba before... Oh, Premium ano? ako, Chi. <laughs> Wala akong atake. Puro, puro fade. Puro, eh magaling pumasa si Mark eh. Kakat lang ako pagkabigay sa akin, one to lang, tas fade. Tas inbound, pagkabigay sa akin. Alam mo yung, eh, ano yun eh, parang yung drill namin ni Gerald, yung sprint, tas pagkakuha, ano agad. Hmm. Puro ganun yung tira ko. Wala ka nga ang dribble masyado eh. Ano nangyari? Parang one dribble pull up, puro ganun. Ang ganda ng laro ko, tatlong quarter lang ako naglaro eh, kasi late ako. Hindi ako nilabas. Tas mga ano siguro ako, 33. 23 points. Walang atake yun. Parang first time ko yun eh. Isa isang game, wala talaga kahit isang atake. Na dun, na dun, na buhay din yung dance out. Kamo sa improvement mo? Okay na okay. Okay na okay. Malayo? Layo, para sa akin. So this is the second section of the day. They have to make 200 mate shots. So we're here, uh, tapusin na namin 200 mate shots and kita tayo mame. So now we're home and uh, they're done doing 200 mate shots. And if I'm gonna summarize the whole day, there's nothing special. Nothing special in terms of uh, doing something new. It's the same routine over and over again. Wake up 3 a.m. and then uh, finish the training at 6 a.m and then go home, take a good rest, then train again in the afternoon, and then after that, uh, dinner, and then you go to sleep for preparation of training the next day. So, I mean, this is quite boring. Nakakasawa. And as human beings, we tend to find happiness and fun each and every day. So, kapag nakakaramdam na tayo ng moments na parang uh, nakakalungkot na or paulit-ulit na, we tend to back down on our goals, back down on our plans, our dreams, and instead of changing the effort, we most of the time change the goal. We most of the time change the plan. And it's normal. It's normal because everyone wants to have fun. Everyone wants to be happy, but it really takes someone special to do these kinds of sacrifices each and every day because this one's hard. The training that we are doing is the easiest part of the journey. It's not actually hard. To run full speed is not hard. To make 200 made shots is not hard. The hard part is what we do outside of the training. Can we stay committed? Because all of the things that we've been doing for almost two weeks now, it's the same routine over and over again. So at first, the excitement is there. And yung gana mo, and yung saya. Kasi gusto mo may ma-achieve ka. For a very long time, hindi ka na train and nagbigyan ka ng chance mag-train. At first, you are excited, of course. It's fun. Pero habang tumatagal, when you feel that there's nothing special in what you are doing, it's the same routine over and over again, dun mo matitest kung sino talaga yung dedicated, kung sino talaga yung driven, kung sino talaga yung kaya mag-sacrifice. And those are the people who really uh, get and achieve what they want in life and uh, make the most out of the time that they have each and every day. So, guys, I'm meaning to say, as, as human being, I really do feel those things you know, i feel bored i feel the the feeling na parang nasasawa ka sa ginagawa mo and uh, during those times i just uh, think of the things why am i doing this i just think of my dream and konting sakripisyo lang konting tiis lang once i get what i want few months few years from now i'm gonna be able to live the life that i want so uh, for most of you na nasasawa na or you're starting to get bored and uh, you want to make new things it's okay to make new things it's okay to do something else but stay committed to your promises stay committed to the plan stay committed to your goals to your dreams because one day pag nakuha mo na yung gusto mo you can do almost anything that you want so guys I'm gonna sleep now tulog na sila and maaga pa kami tomorrow uh, this is hard and uh, the challenge is paano mo i-enjoy yung journey mo kahit na nahihirapan ka na so 
Uh, that's one of the things that I'm mastering right now. I'm enjoying the journey, kahit na mahirap siya. Same thing, same routine over and over again. So guys, that's gonna be my advice. Enjoy the journey, even though there's nothing special in each day. It's the same thing, pero guys, you really have to sacrifice things if you want to get what you want. So guys, this is Coach Mav. I'm gonna see you again, and thank you for watching. I really thank all of you for all the support. Please keep watching. Make sure to take down notes para mas mag-effective yung panonood nyo. Guys, this is Coach Mav. I'm gonna see you again, and God bless you all.